Let's take a look at the constraints inferred by rectangles in AutoCAD Mechanical 2013. If infer constraints is turned on, as you draw a rectangle, horizontal, vertical and perpendicular constraints are inferred. If fillets are included in the rectangle, additional tangent and equal constraints are inferred. Once constrained, the rectangle retains its shape when grip editing. Pressing the shift key relaxes the constraints to allow individual fillets or edges to be modified. Now let's take a look at symmetrical lines. When drawing a symmetrical line, symmetrical constraints are inferred between the center line and the lines. Once constrained, the lines remain symmetrical about the center line when grip editing. Now let's take a look at center lines. When adding a center mark to a circle, perpendicular and equal constraints are inferred between the circle and the center mark lines. Once constrained, the center mark retains its shape, position and overshoots beyond the circle when grip editing. When drawing a hole pattern, concentric and equal constraints are inferred between the center lines and the holes. Once constrained, any changes made to one of the holes are applied to all holes within the pattern. Pressing the shift key relaxes constraints to allow the selected hole to be modified.